Welcome to the C learning video for the alignment of a free flight rapier machine. Warning. Read and fully understand the operator's maintenance and safety manuals before using or servicing this machine. Failure to follow operating maintenance or safety instructions could result in serious injury. For this part of the e-learning you will need the following tools. A set of Allen keys. The flat spanner number 17. Loosen the two holding bolts of the cam box or dobby cover. We remove this cover so you are able to access the rest of the machine more easily. Remove the cover. Loosen the three holding bolts of the rapier wheel cover one by one. Make sure when loosening the last bolt that you don't damage the cover. Remove the cover. Now we will place all the frames down. Press the pick finding button to put the frames down. Move the two rapier tapes to the center of the machine by using the slow motion buttons. Loosen the four bolts on the rapier wheel clamp so the wheel can move freely. Now you are able to remove the rapier tape out of the machine. Please place the rapier tapes away in a clean safe place so they can't be damaged. Here you can see the back view while removing the rapier tape. Remove the rapier guide by loosening the two holding bolts. Loosen the two holding bolts of the lower cooling block and take the block out. Make sure that you don't lose the thickness plates behind the cooling block. Remove the holding clamp on the rapier wheel. Remove the rapier wheel. Take the lubrication pin out. Now you are able to remove the lubrication pin support. Remove the upper cooling block by loosening the two holding bolts. Place the upper and lower oil guide to this maximum inner position. We do this so you are able to do the correct height setting later on.
Remove the intermediate piece from the machine. Loosen the clamp of the gripper tape guide. Thank you for watching this e-learning video for the preparation of the free flight alignment on our Optimax i machine. Questions or remarks please contact us.